Oh, what is up, everybody? Jeez, man. Poor car. <laughs> oh, that's a good way to start the video, isn't it? Bloody. God, I look red, don't I? Probably a bit sunburnt. Um, so, the other day when I went down to Adelaide, uh, this, this beast was leaking a little bit of coolant, and I thought it was this here. Because this here, I just bloop, just pulled it off. Like, there, was, there wasn't even any pressure on there. And it, it, checked it, I checked it from... Uh, Truro to Blanc, uh, Blanchetown to Truro. And there was no liquid on there. There was no coolant. So I was like, oh, cool, it's fixed it. No, it hasn't. And one of the worst parts is that I just degreased and washed all of that because it was covered in that. Because me thinking that I fixed it, and I bloody didn't. So I'm I'm positive it's the new cap because like I, I don't even there's barely even any pressure on it. It is so easy to get undone, and that spring, like it's really there's lots of mo movement as well. Not that you can see it there. There's lots of movement in the top. Well, in here. And you can, so I don't know if you can see, but around the top of that, that this O-ring here, well, it's not going to show it now, but there was, it was sealed around some parts, and then some parts was water. I, I could see water all the way to the edge. So I'm thinking it's just either, either the O-ring... Well, it's put. It's it's probably a combination of both. Like that, that is so easy to put on there. That that radiator cap. It should not be that easy. I should be able to. There should be a fair bit of tension to it, you know. So I I think it's a combination of the spring being a little bit worn, and the rubber's being worn as well. And, and it's just bypassing. And what it, it's, it's bypassing just here. I I think it's like might be squirting, leaking down, and hitting my fans, which then it's just throwing it everywhere because it's everywhere. It's all down here. All, all over here, all up here, it's everywhere. So I'm hoping it's that. If not, then I'm going to be out of a car for a little while. But you can see, like, you can see up here, I just bloody cleaned and pressure washed it. So I'm pretty pissed off that that happened. But unfortunately, that's cars for you. I mean, it's been a pretty good car. I've, I've owned it for uh, three, probably five years. So that's the longest I've ever owned any vehicle. No, except for my cafe r racer. I've owned that for like, I don't even know how many years. Um, but yeah, yeah, so that's, hopefully when I get home, I'll have to let it cool down and I'll put the new cap on it. I'm praying it fixes it because I got the, this is brand, well, not brand new. I got the coolant change 25,000 Ks ago. 20, no, yeah, 25 which is, and um, that coolant's meant to be able to do, I think, like 100,000 at the minimum, or 150, I think. So I'm pretty annoyed that it's been pissing out coolant, but there's nothing I can do about it. I was, was going to fill it up because it's a little bit low, like it's just not sitting at the top where I like it to be, but I'm not going to worry about it because it's, only, it, it's not going to have much time to leak home. It only takes me 15 minutes to drive home, and the whole car has to heat up, build pressure, you know, and, and yeah blah 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 so yeah that's my um fun for the day i'm nearly done i've done 30 gating putting the all the fertilizer through i'm i feel dead i feel really tired i'm almost done um flushing <sighs> being outside and wearing all all of this or wearing i can't even get it yeah, I've, I've got jeans, long sleeve top, and big boots with thick socks on, so I get bloody warm during the day. I actually feel, I've got a headache, actually. But yeah, yeah, sorry about the, Jesus, I'm horrible. But yeah, that's, that's, I don't know, that's sort of it. I'm just, I'm hoping it fixes it. I'm, I really am, because... Oh, it's just going to be a pain in the ass. I'm going to have to go and get it pressure tested to make sure it's not leaking anywhere else. And then more money. I'm going to be out of a car for a little bit, so I'll have to borrow one of the parents' spare cars and, yeah, you know, all that other 
exciting crap that comes with cars. But anyway, that is it for the day. <laughs> Piece of shit, nah. <laughs> that has been a good car. Um, yeah, that's the video for the day. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you're having a nice day. I hope you've had a nice day. I hope you're going to have a nice day. I'll see you tomorrow.